In the 1990s, a hardline coup failed in Moscow, and the Soviet Union dissolved within a year. Around the same time, the U.S. Nuclear Regulatory Commission revised their standards for protection against radiation and the Code of Federal Regulations. This was the first major update of the radiation safety regulations in nearly 30 years. In science, the first hybrid positron emission tomography, computed tomography scanner, or PET-CT scanner was introduced in 1998. This scanner is capable of imaging the body's anatomy while also showing metabolic processes happening within the body. Time Magazine declared it the scientific invention of the year for 2000. By 2009, the National Council on Radiation Protection reported that the annual exposure to the average U.S. citizen was about 620 millirem per year, a significant increase since the 1980s. This higher amount of radiation exposure comes mostly as an increase in the number of diagnostic medical tests that involve radiation. Shortly thereafter, the Image Gently and Image Wisely campaigns began to raise awareness of excessive exposures to children and adults and to recommend measures for making imaging procedures safer, such as the reducing of radiation dose. In 2015, the U.S. Environmental Protection Agency issued recommendations to keep X-ray doses to patients as low as can be achievable without interfering with the quality of patient care. Their guidance report titled, Radiation Protection Guidance for Diagnostic and Interventional X-ray Procedures, is issued to federal facilities that use X-ray equipment to perform medical tests and treatments.